Welcome to Draw Fee, where we take your dumb ideas and make even dumber drawings. I'm Karina. I'm Jacob. And I'm Julia. What? <laughs> I thought you were going to do the intro. <laughs> you do the intro. But and you then started. I helped. <laughs> Disney okay, <fine>. movies. <laughs> Who needs them? They're all around us. They seem to be all of the movies because Disney owns everything. <laughs> Even but you me. know what they don't own? <laughs> I don't think. I didn't research this. Digimon. No one can own Digimon. They are free. They probably don't, but they, they will. might have <laughs> rights to air it. Okay. Because of course they do. They've got their... I was going to say they got their toes in the Digimon pie, which is <laughs> not the phrase. <laughs> yeah. Do you ever just wander into the Digimon kitchen and step toe first? I could find in. two different phrases. <laughs> they made what it horrible. What was the other phrase? Can they you're... dipped their toe. Yeah. Okay. And then, and then thumbs in the pie. Yeah. Thumbs. You got... <laughs> they got their toes and their thumbs in all the pies. All my fingers are thumbs. <laughs> This is a suggestion we got from Christina Knight. They said three words, Digivolved Disney characters. We've done it. So we're combining two things that no one ever thought would be combined. <laughs> we're going to take Disney characters we randomly pull up and we're going to Digivolve them. Yeah. Some behind the scenes here. We pulled up this randomizer <laughs> and I think this is why we were all scrambled in the beginning of this intro it's because the one that it pulled up was Gus from Gus Gus. <laughs> And it's just, or Gus Gus from Gus. It's just We're not Don, sure. It's Don not screaming at a horse on He's the He's wearing a helmet that has an Adam symbol on I it. I refuse to speak in the intro because in my brain, I was just going Gus, Gus from Gus Gus, 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 Gus. Or is Gus. it Gus Gus from Gus? Gus, Gus. movie Gus? Which one's Gus? Gus Gus Gus. Gus Gus, Gus movie horse? <laughs> Gus Gus movie horse. Oh, I'm Gus. sorry. Gus 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 movie horse. Yeah. I'm going to pull up one for me to do that's not Gus. What? What if it's I Gus again? I don't want to talk about Gus anymore. <laughs> Let's see what I get. Gus. Gus, Gus. Oh. <laughs> That's the Pocahontas villain. Governor Ratcliffe, the Governor Pocahontas Ratcliffe. villain. He's the gold one. Mine gold. Mine for the king of Savages, gold. savages. Yeah, he has a whole song oh, about he has how he loves dog. Gold. I yeah. loved the dog when I was the a dog kid. The dog is good. I liked the dog. Ratcliffe okay, so is... Uh, a symbolization of English imperialism and also capitalism. He's one of those sin Digimon. He's, he's one of those sin Digimon. <laughs> he's a representation of a big nasty fella. I'm so excited to see Governor Ratcliffe and Jorts. <laughs> <laughs> I'm thinking like straight out the gate. Right? Yeah. This this shape right here, this body shape. Mm -hmm. Is speaking to me. He it's haunting like a gold me. Coin. It's whispering in your ear. Oh, I'm thinking I want it to be like a big like mouth. Oh, like a mouth should go there, no. right? So that yes. you can scream mine. Yeah, and gold. it can be like my least favorite Digimon, Venomiotismon, my enemy. Venezuelamon. Venomiotismon. He has big feet, and his crotch turns into a face, and I hate him. I hate him with all my heart. Venice Myota Mon, I barely know her. <laughs> I barely know her, Mon. Because this is representative of the devouring nature of capitalism. imperialism. Both. And he's capitalism. both a capitalist and an imperialist. And yeah, colonialism. He sucks. Yeah, he's everything that sucks about history all, all in one. I'm thinking this is just like coins, right? Gold oh. coins. And so... It's a mouthful of gold coins, ever devouring. Symbolic. I like it. And this is still going to be like the torso. So we'll have another head, of course. Yeah. Oh. It also kind of looks like Monument Valley that you've drawn, which feels appropriate because <laughs> it's taking over America. This Digimon, I mean. Yeah, this is a Digimon. Yeah, this is a Digimon. A this Digimon Digimon's now. taking America by storm. Yeah. What's the matter, <laughs> Disney? You made this character? It's a Digimon now. It's We're a, taking it. It's a Digimon. <laughs> this is our act of rebellion. <laughs> what are you going to do about it? Sue us? <laughs> you made this? I made this. <laughs> don't sue us, please. Please don't sue us. <laughs> and I, I think we're going to have like some chest eyes. Yeah. Chest eyes. Yes, because you've got kind of like the collar thing going on. Mm-hmm. 
Maybe that's sort of like... You're really doing some design work yeah, today. Yeah, you're using your whole brain. Yeah, I'm, really. I'm really thinking about a thing or two. You've this is your third eye. This is a shame because that means that Jacob has the one droppy brain cell today. Uh-oh. Which means that Karina and I are screwed. Yeah. So we're going to have the chet, the devouring chest eyes. Uh-huh. And then his other head will it's be, like you know, like up, up here doing its thing. We'll figure that out Looks in a minute. Like a little hat. <laughs> is it like a guy that's like riding the the thing? Is, aren't there some Digimon where it's like two creatures? Yeah, oh, there has one. Yeah, yeah, probably. Of I still don't know anything about Digimon. Was well, the one where it's like the dude on the clock? Yeah, yeah, I remember that one. Yeah, Clockamon, Clockamon, <laughs> Cl- Clockamon, Cl- Clockamon. So we'll get sort of... The thing is that Digimon can be anything. Mm-hmm. But I guess if you have to simplify it, they're either a dinosaur, a robot, a sexy person, or like a dragon that's not a dinosaur. <laughs> or they're just a gun. They're just a gun. Or they're just like a friend. I don't know what category this one falls in. This one falls into like the category where it's just like sort of a weirdo. Yeah. Some of them are just weirdos. Yeah. Some of them are horrific monsters. They're just like weird little freaks, weird little nasty freaks, and we love them for it. I know, I know, I haven't been helpful in educating you on like the aesthetics of Digimon. Nothing could help me, Karina. <laughs> no, like <laughs> watching the show couldn't help me. Yeah, yes, a Digimon can be anything. A Digimon can be anything. It is what I'm learning. Um, you know what's fun about this design too? It looks is that like a- Guzzlord? It does look like Guzzlord. Well, I was thinking that it kind of looks like. One of those sea mines, which is fun because it's another form of mine, like his song. <laughs> mine. <laughs> mine. <laughs> Julia, what? where does your brain it looks come, like a sea mine. come from? That's sometimes. my favorite song of his where he sings about how his parents were divorced and he's afraid to love. <laughs> 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 Let's just keep going and see how deep we can dig this reference. <laughs> I think he looks like a sea mine. One of those ocean mines. If you think it looks like a sea mine, let us know in the comments. <laughs> if people can see a focaccia bun on pretty, burner. A pretty good hand I just drew. Yeah, you did. You yeah. Really that out. What that looks heck? great. <laughs> Where did that come from? You know what that means fuck? is that you can never erase it. Yeah. I feel like every time I, I write a letter where I'm like, ooh, that looks really nice is because I've spelled the word wrong and then I have to erase that letter. <laughs> no regrets. No regrets. <laughs> yeah, because I feel like he's doing like sort of an attack where the mouth opens up and some s- bad stuff happens. It also looks like he's doing the crescendo of a Broadway song. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's doing the reprise of one of his greatest yeah. hits. Like um, where he's talking about how his parents got the divorce. Yes. <laughs> well, he's saying, you know, he's. This is when he's talking it out. I feel yeah. like a lot of Broadway plays are just. Um, this is song the therapies. Yeah, this is the era after mine. This this is, era. He's singing bad blood. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's a false face. Yeah, the eyes are like little button eyes. Oh, he's one of them puppet types. He's a puppet type <laughs> that we've heard so much about. I mean, if you think about it, Ratcliffe is like a puppet for like British Empire and, and capitalism. Bruh. Bruh. That's deep. <laughs> when he dies, he's not bringing that money with him anywhere, but he's giving it back to his... his... Does he die in the movie? It's been a while since I watched Pocahontas. How does I he die? don't remember if he dies. Does he get, does he get shot? Old age. <laughs> or does he just no. get arrested? <laughs> I don't remember. I'm gonna look this up. <laughs> shot. Let's play shot or arrested. <laughs> well, because they have the or whole old age. <laughs> they have the whole savages song where yeah. they come together, and then and then and, it turns out he was the savage. Yeah, yeah. So then I'm, I'm just wondering, because then he like goes to shoot someone, and then he shoots he shoots John Smith instead. Yeah. So he's the one who gets shot. So we we've got shot. <laughs> All right, let's see. So he either got arrested or died of old age. Sorry, I'm just really thinking this out here. No. Oh, he was arrested. Boo. Got like and then he was probably let like free because, you know. Yeah. But he would definitely be dead by now from old age. Oh, 100%. So that's good. Oh, his, his pug's name is Percy. 
Yeah, I like the pug. Yeah, Percy rules. So this is like the data of this character. <laughs> all, getting all nasty on your computer. This is how he survived on. Yeah. In data form. <laughs> I do have to say the entry for Percy on this dick... Dicky <laughs> Dicky Wiki. Dicky Wiki. Dicky Wiki. Dicky Wiki. Is that the horse or the man? <laughs> Dicky Wiki. Dicky Wiki from Dicky Wiki. No. <laughs> Percy from the Disney Wiki <laughs> does say that his home was formerly England and currently Virginia, which makes it sound like Percy's alive out there somewhere. <laughs> currently. <laughs> Currently, Virginia. Still living there. <laughs> yeah. Hanging out. If you go to Virginia, you'll find him. He didn't die. He just stopped living in England. <laughs> <laughs> if you can call that living. Hey. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So his digivolution is just that he becomes nasty. Yeah. I think he's like one of the nasty ones. Yeah. Still got the cape. I'm really pleased with this design. I feel yeah, like this is big it's very brain. Good. I feel like this works. It, it feels like does. a Kingdom Hearts, actually. Does that mean it's not a Digimon? Does it work too good? <laughs> Anything could be Digimon, Jacob. Yeah, we've established that. We've established this. Well, I'm committing to it. This yeah. is, yeah. This just, is just Ratcliffe. Clarify that in the render. You got to remember this. Okay, I'll remember. That he's gold. He's gold? Yeah, because he has that song where he's gold. like, see how I glitter. And he's wearing gold. That's so part of the mind song. Yeah. There we go. I've left a note for myself. So <laughs> Hell yeah. Because when you digivolve, you change outfits. Okay. So yeah. So it'll be like a, gold ver a glowing gold version. Yeah, and here it is right now. Whoa. You whoa, remember. I remembered. I did it perfectly. <laughs> whoa. Such incredible gold rendering <laughs> on this drawing if I did that. I probably didn't. Anyways, I'm done. Guess Karina, we'll you want to do one? Yes. I guess I got to get a random character. Let's. Gus, 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 Gus. Uh, oh. Jafar. Jafar's a fun one. Yeah. Jafar. I love Jafar. I know that guy. I was obsessed with Aladdin as a kid. I yeah? guess we're going villains yeah. only, huh? Damn. Villains only run. Gus is the greatest villain of them all. <laughs> the horse question mark. <laughs> horse, 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 Gus, Gus. Baby Jafar becomes a horse. <laughs> he becomes a horse. Because what's his whole thing? He like evolves in the movie. Yeah, to a big genie. genie. And he has a, a bird. Yes, Iago. Iago, Gilbert Godfrey. <laughs> Gilbert Godfrey as Iago. <laughs> Good for him. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah. He also got snakes. He has a lot of snakes. Because he wants like power yeah. and eternal life, I think, are the things he's looking for. Yeah, yeah well, he wants to uh, become an all-powerful genie. Yeah. Yeah, so... Yeah. He's going to be, because if he's in his hot human form now, he's got to turn into something monstery because that's how it goes. Mm -hmm. You go baby, toddler, cute animal, sexy human, something long and dragony. That's normal. <laughs> I love that. So this is so. going to be like the, the dragony Jafar. To be fair, Jafar... Turns into like that very long genie at the end. Yeah. Yeah. So we're gonna go. We're gonna go snake. Oh, like a swerpent. Yeah. I just finished raising a Digimon on my watch yesterday. That maybe that's the energy I'm going for here. Is it a serpent? Kind of. I'm not sure what it is. Honestly, I should probably look at more images of it. It's like a serpent. <laughs> it's kind of like an apocalypse robo serpent. You know how sure, it is. Yeah, of course. Yeah. So I do want to say fun fact. Aladdin, my favorite Disney film growing up. Fun fact. I watched it so many times. I just remember it because I have this earworm of Jafar saying, Yes at the end when he becomes the genie and then <laughs> That's he a fun grows earworm up. to have. <laughs> yeah, it's how he says yes and it's very weird. It's a lot of fun. I have to think. This is a fun reference image. It's a nice angle, completely different than what I'm trying to do. Yeah. I have a picture of Jafar up on my phone if you want it. 
<laughs> it's it's my background. Julia always has a picture of Jafar on her phone. <laughs> it's my lock screen. <laughs> <laughs> oh no! If I if I block it in like this, he's got the Vialzaman motif. Fuck. Fuck. <laughs> he can have that. Yeah. This Let is, him have it. <laughs> this is a Vialzaman. I forgot that he does turn into a giant cobra in the movie. Does he? Well, mm -hmm. there we go. He's gonna do it again. He's always turning into stuff. Baby. Because Jasmine's in the hourglass and then Jafar's fighting off Aladdin and then she's suffocating under the pressure of the sand. Yeah. Sucks for her. Yeah. Yeah, Jafar's a freak. Jasmine doesn't have a gray in that movie, but she does have a tiger. Yeah. She has a tiger and not a lot of agency. Nope. <laughs> yeah. What more do you want in life? <laughs> She also has that wonderful combo of wanting to marry rich, but also not wanting to marry someone rich. <laughs> We've all been there, sister. <laughs> okay. She wants to marry like a normal person who happens to be rich. Yes. Also. Yeah. She doesn't want to date a street rat, but also she wants to date a street rat. Yeah. yeah. She basically okay. wants to date a YouTuber. <laughs> yeah, we're basically street rats. Yeah, basically. <laughs> Gonna be one of these nasty ones. We're really doing all the evil Digimon today. Yeah, it all depends on what Julia rolls. If it's Gus, gonna be a villain's Gus, only. Gus, 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 Gus. If you Gus, roll Gus, Gus you Gus. have to do Gus. Now that we've established what Gus is, it's fair game. <laughs> we still don't know what Gus is. Gus is a horse. Gus is a horse that plays soccer. I looked it up before we recorded. He was wearing a helmet. Actually, Why? he's not even a horse. He's a mule. What? This changes everything. <laughs> okay, I've looked it up. Wow, this illustration for this is actually fantastic. Is the one where like, they're carrying um, him? Yeah, it's really good. It's really cute. <laughs> oh, that is really good. I like it a lot. Is it like that movie, She's the Man? Except <laughs> Gus pretends- They try to pretend he's a person. <laughs> well, Gus tries to pretend to be a horse to play on the horse soccer team, but really Gus is a mule. Not where I thought you were going with that, but okay. I thought you were going to say they pretend he's a man. <laughs> <laughs> they could do that too. I just liked imagining that a horse soccer but team. he's a mule. <laughs> a horse soccer team was normal, but a mule soccer team is unacceptable. In the world of Gus. I just looked up the plot for this movie. Mm -hmm. A lot of it takes place in Yugoslavia. Yes. Well, that's not what I would have guessed. It's not what I would have guessed. <laughs> <laughs> okay i don't know where i'm going with this but it's a digimon you know yeah just feel it out as you go yeah do i want that to be his mouth do i want to give him a real nasty is that his mouth? tongue then yeah well it's supposed mm -hmm. to be his goatee his goatee tongue could be his goatee become tongue you can have two mouths <laughs> gee jafar why does mom let you have two mouths <laughs> <laughs> one's the nasty mouth yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this He's is kind of giving me so Yu-Gi-Oh vibes icky. too. I'm trying to like remember, because if what's his name? Aladdin. No, the other one. <laughs> Sultan. Yaga. Abu. Apu. From Pocahontas. Ratcliffe. Ratcliffe. John Smith. <laughs> John Smith. Oh, I wish I had rolled John Smith. Cocoa. <laughs> um, Should we marry Cocoa though? <laughs> Debatable. Um, Seems pretty chill. Look, my concept here is that there's a group of Digimon, the seven Demon Lord Digimon. I'm trying to think of them. We should all think of them. Let's take a moment to think of them. Yeah. Can we flash them up on the screen? Like... As if they had perished this <laughs> <Yeah>. year. <laughs> rip, rip in peace, all of you. Can we flash them up with a song that kind of sounds like Arms of the Angels? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, because they're not angels. They're demon lords. <laughs> <laughs> it's a negative key. Yeah. Negative key. Negative, Negative key. key. <laughs> the new musical concept just dropped. Wake up, babe. <laughs> <laughs> new music just got invented. <laughs> Wait until you hear negative key. <laughs> it's the sound you've been looking for. Oh, man. What would that sound like even? I don't know. I don't know what it would even be. Maybe if you like reversed all the sharps and flats <laughs> in a key, but then it would just be in a different key. 
Oh my god, this must be the secret chord <laughs> David played and it pleased the Lord. <laughs> <laughs> it was negative key. <laughs> we did it. We got there. We got to the nonsense part of the episode. <laughs> Yay. You always get there eventually. Yeah, it's only a matter of time. Negative key is apparently a math term. <laughs> that seems right. <laughs> Mathematicians be. are always up to some real yeah. nonsense. Making things up. Liars. Yeah, they just make it up and they're like, oh, what about imaginary numbers? And I'm like, yeah, dude, I can. Yeah, what about them? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you tell them, Jacob. <laughs> okay, let's get some more shapes in here. I don't know where I'm going with this, but that's okay. He's one of them nasty Digimon. I like the head curtains, look really nice. Thank you. I guess Jafar has head curtains. What does Jafar look like underneath the turban? Do we He's know? Bald. Is I don't he think bald? We know. I want him to be bald. <laughs> I want him to have like a really cute haircut. <laughs> like some, some bangs. He has bangs. Yeah. I feel like these aren't the correct eyes for him. Those are like the friend eyes. We need faux eyes. <laughs> yeah, this looks scary. <laughs> he is scary. Am I allowed to look up reference? You can do whatever you want. Oh, okay. I offered to show you what Jafar looked like. No, not of him. Because there's one demon lord that I'm thinking of. Because I don't want him to look like Bialzaman. Bialzaman does not deserve that. Not my man. So I'm going to make you look like Barbamon. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ba 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 man. Ba 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 man. I love the Demon Lord Digimons, and not just because Bialzaman is one of them. I just think they're neat. They represent the seven sins. Whoa! Get it? I get it. <laughs> Which one does Bialzaman represent? Gluttony. Gluttony. Yeah. I wouldn't have guessed that. It's because he always wants more. He wants more power. Dang. Really makes you think. Yeah. I found a listing that has all of Jafar's hairstyles. What? All of them? All of he has them. multiple? Yeah, because he disguises himself a lot. But it's listed on it's listed on fan pop under a category of favorite hairstyles slash headpiece. Favorite Spelled incorrectly. They were too distracted by how sexy he is. And it yeah. does say that he is bald in one of these. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> and then when he's a genie, he has the the little like top the little top ponytail thing. Oh, yeah, I yeah. should that give I forgot him that. the term but for. But so does genie. But so does genie. I they think it's a genie that. thing. I think it's a genie yeah. thing. Yeah. Um there's also one where he's wearing a top hat. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right, cool. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just drawing a nasty boy. And Welcome. looking and looking at pictures of Barbamon. Welcome to Drawfee. Where, where we, we don't know what we're doing, where but we're we draw a nasty, nasty boy. boy and look at pictures of Barbamon. The ponytail is a snake. Yes. 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 This will all become clear in time. This is a snake. <laughs> we're asking you to trust right now. Yeah. We're we're really on a trust system right now because this is not coming together the way I thought it would. <laughs> I feel like we're getting there. Yeah, I just feel like I'm taking a long time, but I guess I'm allowed to because it's a three-person episode, so. We have to account for Nathan's yeah. time. Pretend Nathan is also working on this. He's here in spirit, Nathan's, guiding my hand. <laughs> yeah, Nathan's <laughs> ghostly hand <laughs> resting atop Karina's. I was about to Google Jafar. I forgot that he was directly to my left. <laughs> He's on there. the screen. He's, He's there, there waiting. Yeah. He's there for you. <laughs> Move over, Nathan. I can't see my reference. He's so ugly. I hate what I've done. But he does track. I yeah. just feel like this, He's got good shapes. His his head shapes a bit much. I'm going to oh. have to like shave it down a little bit. Just... He looks <laughs> like Vegeta a little bit. He does look a little like Vegeta. <laughs> <laughs> he's got that Vegeta hairline. Yeah, yeah he's got that Vegeta hairline. <laughs> Poor guy. <laughs> Where it's somehow like simultaneously down in between his eyebrows it's and the also most... halfway up his head. It's the most severe widow's peak. Yeah. It implies that... I mean, it doesn't because we Vegeta as a kid had the same widow's peak, but 
if you think about it, like just looking at it as an adult, it implies that as a kid, his hairline was right above his eyebrows. And then he started balding from there. He had yeah. no forehead at first, but no one else has hair like that. That's royal hair. Prince Vegeta only. <laughs> and his father, King Vegeta, who looked like him, but with a mustache. He has the royal balding pattern. Hey, that was his father? Yeah. What the fuck? Okay. Who was his father? King Vegeta. The one with a mustache. He had a mustache. It looked like Vegeta with a mustache. I thought that was Vegeta. <laughs> well, later, Vegeta also has a mustache. <laughs> okay, that's just confusing. You're going to have to... <laughs> hey. <laughs> <laughs> Any some, anyone can grow a mustache, criticisms. Karina. Can you? Yeah. What the fuck? And and how then come you've what, never done it? Will I be my own dad if I do that? Yes. Oh, he has a goatee. Oh yeah, he has a goatee. That's right. Not just a mustache, <laughs> but he has the same hair. He looks like he rode in on his Harley on his chopper. He rode in on his chopper to go to the the spice competition where the people spice just eat. competition. Yeah, where they eat like the the chili peppers. Oh, yeah, like mm. spicy food. Yeah. Not like who's got the tastiest spice blend. Yeah, no. who's the best <laughs> spice girl? <laughs> we all know it's Kimberly. Yeah. <laughs> My favorite thing about anime. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Please tell us. Specifically Dragon Ball Z. Mm -hmm. Is that it, it tries to convince us that if you have a child, that child has to have your same hairstyle. And yes. that's how you know it's your child. Yes. Yes. How else are you supposed to indicate that? If they don't come out of the, <laughs> come out of the womb with a full head of my hair, <laughs> then how do I know? Who's the real parent? Yeah. I feel like I like this. Yeah. This is cool and scary. I agree. Yeah. It's got a, this is a bit of a fusion between Barbamon and Orochimon in a way. It just needs more snakes, really. Maybe the back of the snake body is another snake. <laughs> Oh, the snake, like his butt? Yeah, his, his butt snut. becomes snake? <laughs> his snut? <laughs> I hate that. I'll, I'll fix it in post. Don't look at that. <laughs> Don't look at his snut. Don't look at his snut. You're being gross. <laughs> his eyes are up here. <laughs> Don't yeah, look yeah. at my snut. My eyes are up here. <laughs> Don't look at me or my snut ever again. <laughs> Don't talk to my snut, <laughs> but hit me up anytime. <laughs> Wait, I drew two snuts. Can yeah. Get rid of that one. He's <laughs> got double snuts. <laughs> Gee, Jafarman, how come mom lets you have two snuts? <laughs> two mouths, two snuts. I guess it has one, He's got two, it all. three, four mouths. Oh, my God. You're greedy. That's what you represent. Well, I guess the other one also represents greed. <gasps> gluttony. Yeah, it's gluttony again. <laughs> I'm so sorry to Bealzamon, my beloved. You don't deserve this comparison, but. <laughs> Is Bealzamon gluttony? Yes. We, talked we just about talked this. about this. What were you looking up? Looking at Jafar's <laughs> hairstyles. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> I literally just Googled Digimon so that I could know what the hell Digimon look like because I forgot That's during fair. the course of this episode. This is the one I was looking at. Barbamon. That's... He, I think he's greed. That's Bat Santa. Can I stop? Yeah. I think I should stop. You're welcome to stop whenever you want. Yeah. I'll, I'll make this look even more like a Digimon in post. Bada bing, bada boom. Wow. There I it did is. It. That's a Digimon. Whoa. Look at that Digimon. Ah. It's in your wires. <laughs> it's in my wires. Ew, Ew. I don't want him on my computer. <laughs> we put him on everyone's computer. Yeah. He's, he's in your computer now. Enjoy it. Let me draw so we can make him leave the computer. Julia. <laughs> All right. Say it with me now. Gus. 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 <laughs> It's Sebastian. That's a cute picture of him. What a little dance. This is the hero Digimon. Yeah, he's going to defeat the other two. Yeah, the sure about lords. That? In digital combat. All right. <laughs> so Sebastian's a crab. Lobster. He's a lobster? Crabster. No, he's a crab. Or is Wait. he a lobster? Someone look it up. Uh-oh. He's, a, he's, he's a, lobster. a crab. Or is he a crab? <laughs> 
his body looks like a crab, but his face. <laughs> Not the American stand-up comedian Sebastian. <laughs> Little mermaid. <laughs> Little mermaid. <laughs> the first question is he a crab or a lobster? <laughs> Sebastian, full name Horatio Thelonious Ignatius Crustaceus Sebastian. That sounds like a spell. Is a crab. Why has he got like so much of a head then? It's like coming out of where the crab face usually goes. Because he's a cartoon, Jacob. But it makes him look a little more like a lobster. <laughs> he has it? a shell like a crab. But he's got He's, he's got, got that long. crab ass. He got long what like do a you lobster. Want? He's got crab bits. But he's got length. He's Crabs got can be length. long. I don't want to see I'm going to Google a long crab. Long crab. <laughs> All right, Julia's drawing a man. Well, that was Karina's rules, right? It's if you got... You got yeah, the... Sebastian kind of looks like a rookie, so he should evolve into a sexy man. A sexy man. That's how okay. it works. Well, <laughs> yeah, he's got to be hot. I wanted him to have like a cool, like, like I'm on the ocean. I got to protect my noggin from getting sunburned <laughs> bandana. And also I'm a crab. And also I'm a crab. Or I used to be a crab. I googled long crab and all it's showing me is the crab with the long legs. Yeah, they got long legs. But long bodies? That is the domain of lobsters. His body isn't that long. He's just got a big head. That's what's so wrong about it. Is there a leg count difference between the two? Probably. I feel like no one knows how many legs lobsters have. <laughs> Has anyone sorta, actually seen a lobster? They're just sort of all up and down. That Doubt. <laughs> Julia's just drawing a strong pirate. Yeah, that's what you do. I will say that with a lot of humanoid Digimon, I feel like if it's not like too monstery and mm -hmm. like it, if it doesn't have like a tail or animal bits it typically has the eyes covered so as to not be too obviously humanoid <laughs> to perfect down, that's what they the do <laughs> great it's just a guy <laughs> no i'm a digimon a digital monster <laughs> Don't That's question me is. further. What? Where is that torso where is he going? going? He's doing like a, a lean. <laughs> He's singing. <laughs> Look at how, how joyous he is. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All, all humanoid Digimon have like, like they don't look too human. So they typically have their eyes covered and they look like they have some sort of dark fetish. Dark fetish. What would Sebastian's dark fetish be? Um, Do you temperature have a... play. <laughs> temperature play. <laughs> he eats crab. <laughs> He's a cannibal. <laughs> oh, no. I hate this. Yo, that's cool. I like it. <laughs> no. Julia, you're mine. <laughs> I'm uncomfortable. <laughs> Help me. I'm scared. No, this is how it's supposed to be. It's how the Digimon gods want it to be. What are you even going to do with this? It's like a flesh claw. Yes. It's going to slap on them. Yeah, it's like, <laughs> ew, ew. <laughs> <laughs> Don't touch me with it. <laughs> it doesn't even benefit you to have. <laughs> but it's working. I think it's great. I love it. Thank it's, you. It's cool, but in a way that makes me uncomfortable. <laughs> I mean, splitting the arm didn't feel great to do, but it also felt great to do. It's what they would have wanted. Who's they? The Digimon God. <laughs> 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 Shout out to uh, King Drazzle or whatever the fuck your name is. King Drazzle? <laughs> That's the Digimon God. <laughs> it's called King Drazzle? Something like that. I have to look up Digimon God. Why do they have a God? Do they have religion? <laughs> I thought we were making a joke about the, the artist behind Digimon. Because I feel like that would be the God of Digimon, right? But their creator? Right? Anybody? <laughs> We're all Googling Digimon Where's God. Google, this says Digimon God is just God. <laughs> well, there's there's like the reigning Digimon guy, and his name is King Drazzle. Oh, I see it. 
He's a guy. King Drazzle. Or Mod. Why is one of these Our pictures Discord like mod? an anime girl? <laughs> Although there are many God Man, God Beast, <laughs> Evil God, and Demon God type Digimon, only the Digimon Sovereigns, King Drazzle, and the Homeostasis are ever identified as God. I clicked on King Drazzle and <laughs> Vin Diesel popped up immediately because it was an ad. <laughs> but for a second, I was like, whoa. <laughs> no way. No way. Look, Digimon has some whack lore. King Drazzle is a 9,000 Digimon. The heck does that mean? You know, it's a 9,000 Digimon. What's not clicking? <laughs> One of its attacks is called Huge Crystal. Yeah. This crystal is big. <laughs> Fire's a gigantic crystal. Oh, Julia, I've just noticed you covered the mouth too. That's how you know I it's like a Digimon. This. Yeah, I've decided to make a Silent Hill instead. It's like a ninja a crab Digimon man. can be a Silent Hill. Just looking at the Wikipedia, or I'm sorry, the Digimon fandom wiki of King Drazzle shows me an orb, a crystalline looking angel type dude, a tree, and an anime girl. Yes. That's Digimon, baby. I saw all that too, and I was like, which one's King Drazzle? <laughs> They're all King Drazzle. That makes sense. I like this lean. Yeah. Very cash. <laughs> I'm very excited to see I kind of pictured him floating in the water a little bit, like doing a pose like that. Is he still singing under the sea? Yeah, because he's under the sea. That's his main attack. <laughs> it's called under the sea, and he pulls you under the ocean with his weird arm. And just drowns and you. drowns you. <laughs> Sorry, I, I like went dead silent mid-thought because there was like thunder outside. I think we've angered somebody. <laughs> Is it Drazzle? Yo! King Drazzle! <laughs> what up? What up? I was going to say I'm excited to see what you do with this arm. I mean, I think it's just going to be another another crab arm. Perfect. Another so, crarm. Crarm. Do harm for the crarm. <laughs> Made it too long. Do harm with the crarm. Very long arms in general. That's okay. Yeah, it don't have to be normal arms. Yeah? It's Digimon, baby. It's just Digimon. You know how it is. I drew a weird snake, man. <laughs> 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 it's honestly impressive I even gave him arms. It's more than y'all watching deserved. You'll take what you get. Yeah, you'll live with you'll it. You'll live with it. <laughs> I looked up the Digimon that I was also thinking of, the one I just finished raising on my watch, and it does have arms, even though it's a weird apocalypse snake. It's called Nidhogmon. Nidhogmon. Yeah. Oh, wow. He's got tiny little arms. I didn't realize that for the longest time. What kind of tiny little things do you think he does with those tiny little arms? Plays the keyboard. Plays a tiny little <laughs> keyboard. Yeah. Does little crafts. <laughs> yeah. Soap making. Oh, are we adding more arms? Oh well, yeah. Yeah, he's a crab. He needs them. For what? Grabbing, holding little Soap stuff. Soap making. <laughs> holding stuff. All the better to hold you under the sea with. Yeah. <laughs> Julia, this is wild. I love it. This is good. I do love that he's just wearing like a bodysuit. Yeah, he's wearing a scuba suit. Oh. So his dark kink is asphyxiation. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Or one of those rubber suits. Oh, Ooh. he likes all kinds of stuff. Damn, Sebastian, you're a freak. Yeah, you nasty, Sebastian. <laughs> I do love that his attack is he just drowns you. <laughs> he just drowns you. <laughs> this man flashy. comes out of the ocean and grabs you and drowns you. What do you do? Drown, <laughs> I guess. What else am I going to do? I don't have any undersea capabilities. I'm not supposed to be down there. <laughs> he is wearing fingerless gloves. I'm not going to question accessory. Sort of the mechanics of how those gloves would work. They're custom. Uh, to, go, to go across. <laughs> <laughs> um, this is Sebastian, I think. This is Sebastian Mon. Yeah, you did it. Yeah, I definitely did something. Is this Digimon? Yes. Yeah. All right. He doesn't have eyes. 
<laughs> so it's perfect. <laughs> so you nailed it. Cool. This is him. This is him. This is him. This is it. I this is real. This is me. Everyone will agree. We've made three perfect Digimon. Mm-hmm. Out yes. of three perfect Disney characters. Mm-hmm. Yes. <laughs> the three best Disney the characters. Three best fan favorites. <laughs> Sebastian. <laughs> Jafar. Radcliffe. Yeah. All only second to Gus. <laughs> to Gus, the number one Disney fan favorite. <laughs> Gus, 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 Gus. 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 Thanks for watching, everyone, especially Gus, if you're watching. <laughs> if you're out there, Gus. If you're out there. <laughs> I love you. Leave a suggestion in the comments for other things you'd like to see us draw on the show. If you like the episode, you like the channel, give us a like, give us a subscribe. And you can also <laughs> go over to the Patreon to kick some money our way if you really like us. And we also stream on Twitch every Monday night <gasps> at twitch.tv slash Mm-hmm. And... Mm-hmm. We have a store at DFTBA. Link in the description. We got all this fancy new merch every mm-hmm. everywhere. Go yeah. get some of it. And that's it. Yes. We're sorry. I'm not sorry. It's one of my Digimon sins. Sorry. <laughs>